Let's see how to solve the cubic equation. You can expand the left side, but we will get a long expression, which is hard to solve. So let's do it in a smart way. First, we do a substitution. Let t equals the average of the two bases. So let t equals 2x plus 5. So the first base becomes t plus 2, the second t minus 2. So the given equation would be t plus 2 cubed plus t minus 2 cubed equals 64. To expand the left side, we use the cube formulas. So a, minus, uh, a plus b cubed equals a cubed plus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared plus b cubed. So the first term becomes t cubed plus 3t squared times 2 plus 3t 2 squared plus 2 cubed. For the second term, a minus b cubed equals here's minus plus and minus. So we get t cubed minus 3t squared times 2 plus 3 times t times 2 squared minus 2 cubed equals 64. These two terms cancelled. These two terms cancelled. So we get 2t cubed plus 2 squared 4, 4 times 3, 12, 12 plus 12, 24. So 24t minus 64 equals 0. Both sides divided by 2, so we get t cubed plus 12t minus 32 equals 0. To factor the left side, we play a trick. We break 32 as 8 plus 24, so we get t cubed minus 8 plus 12t minus 24 equals 0. We can write as t cubed minus three, uh, 2 cubed plus 12t minus 24 equals 0. Now for the first two terms, we can use difference cubes formula. A Q minus B Q equals A minus B times A squared plus A B plus B squared. So we get T minus 2 times T squared plus 2T plus B squared, which is 2 squared. For the second two terms, take the common factor 12 out, so we get 12 times T minus 2 equals 0. So we take the new common factor t minus 2 out, so we get t minus 2 times the first term, so t squared plus 2t plus 4, but plus second term 12, actually plus 16 equals 0. So with two possibilities, one is t minus 2 equals 0, the second, t squared plus 2t plus 16 equals 0. For the first one, we get t equals 2. For the second, because the discriminant equals b squared, so 2 squared minus 4a, say 16, equals 4 minus 64 equals negative 60 less than 0. So this one, no real solution. The only real solution for t is 2. Now we get back to x. 2x plus 5 equals t, but now t equals 2. Both sides subtract 5, so we get 2x equals negative 3. So x equals negative 3 over 2 the only real solution for the given equation. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.